I, he, this guy's spirit asked me to come and put this information out there for him. I'm going to say this one time. I might repost it separately. I don't know. Kevin Samuels was hurt people, hurt people. All right. This man, this man was touched by men as a kid. He was, he was molested. He was taken advantage of as a child himself. Kevin Samuels' hate for women comes from, is one of two things. The woman that was supposed to be protecting him from the man did not protect him from the man. So he hated that woman or the woman was chastising him and putting him down as a child and the man that was molesting him gave him a sense of peace and a sense of protection. So running away from the abusive mother figure, the abusive woman to the man that's being soft and sweet but still taking advantage of him allows him to become the guy that we had. So, and that's really what it is. Because it was the first two, it was one of those two things because when those first two came to me. But that's what it was. Whatever woman figure he had in his life, um, what the fuck? I'm sorry, I just read the text. Um, but yeah, so, all right. The, the, the woman, yeah, man, the woman that was supposed to be protecting Cam Kevin Samuels was mentally and physically abusing him. And there was a man that came in, took advantage of his old booty hole. I shouldn't even say it like that, damn. Took advantage, but I mean, that's... The man came and offered him something that the woman wasn't giving him, so he grows up with this hate for women, but he's not healed. So, and it's, it's something that I think about even with the R. Kelly shit. R. Kelly is still alive, but what I think about personally is how he could have changed so many lives if niggas would have got to him before he started doing to people what was done to him. Because if niggas don't know, R. Kelly was raped by his sister and men, like other men. Like he was, he was molested by men and women. So you got this beast ass musician, R. Kelly, going out here perpetuating what he perpetuated, what happened to him to all these other people. And at this point in time, he's on this fucking pedestal and ain't nobody going to tell him about himself. And at this point, he still needs to heal. So it's all of these people that need to heal. And in this society, we have all these people that are so quick to cancel people and to judge people put people down when we don't have to fuck with them. We have to come from a state, a state of understanding. Because if we come from the state of understanding, then we could turn the situation around and make our behavior better. We have to make our behavior better. Instead of looking at what he did and judging him, let's look at what he did and look in the mirror and say, how can I not do that? How can I prevent that from happening again? So instead of canceling Kevin Samuels and canceling R. Kelly and canceling all these motherfuckers, let's understand that these motherfuckers were raped and motherfucking taken advantage of and they never healed. So let's make sure that we heal and don't fucking hurt other motherfuckers. Because just like I said, my mother died when I was 11. I didn't cry till I was in college. So I was perpetuating that same cold unemotionalness on other people. So I was the one still being hurt, hurting other motherfuckers. So if you hurt, you can't hurt other motherfuckers through judging. You cannot judge these people. I mean, judgment and the word judge goes through different things. But judgment in terms of judging ourselves to grow instead of judging other people to put it on Instagram and do all this shit out here for shit that don't matter. 
But his spirit told me to put that out in the air. I did my job. And, um, yeah, I did my job. And that's, that's, that's the Kevin Samuel shit. That's what, that's what happened with him. Let's grow. Let's not, let's not keep talking about all of the low vibrational shit. Let's not talk about all the, all the hate shit, all that other shit. Let's grow. Let's, 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 let's get to the growth. Let's get to what we, let's get to the realness of the real situation. Man, people coming in late to the sermon. We got niggas coming in late to the sermon. French, you missed the, uh, you missed, 